Hey guys, I know that the lighting on this is way off. Way off. <laughs> but I have to make this video now. I'm even going to leave this in there because I need it to be true to who I am. This video has zero, nothing, zip, zilch to do with weight loss. So if you're only here for weight loss, <laughs> you don't have to stay. This is a truly, truly personal video that I'm making in a bad lighting situation because I have to make it now while my, my thoughts are jumbled, but while my feelings are fresh and while I can speak from my heart and from my mind and not have any time to say, no, Anita, maybe you shouldn't do that because sometimes I wonder what's appropriate on YouTube and what isn't appropriate on YouTube. And I have finally come to realize that what's appropriate is whatever we choose to put out there as long as it's in good taste, right? <sighs> People start YouTube channels for many different reasons. Some start it to make money, some start it to have a place to talk about weight loss, some start it because they're jabber jaws like myself and oh, we just figured it out and isn't it a great place? There's about a zillion and one reasons to have a YouTube channel and when I started mine I never realized the impact that it would have on me. I was just laying on my bed talking and I did it and I posted it after watching hours and hours and hours of other people's YouTube. And in in since I have started my YouTube channel, I have tried as hard as I can to remember everybody and their names and where they live and become as personable and you know not just another face I don't want you guys to think you're just another person watching me and I try to do the best I can and I think I do a pretty good job but as my numbers get higher and the original 35 <laughs> higher than the original 35 it's a little harder to do but but I'm when, this is one of the reasons for this video is I just want you guys to know that while lately I haven't been able to reply to all your comments not only do I read them all but I take in everything that you guys say I know who you are I know where you live and I appreciate you all and I love you all so much I don't know why I'm saying y'all when I live in Southern California um, and and in doing that I have made of course more close friends than others some of us we know each other by name and it's you know we wave out in YouTube land and um, I made in the original 35 two really good friends one of them her name is Fiona Bell and she sent me this shirt when we when I first started in fact patty whack isn't even spelled right because that was back when for the original 35 I kept going back with the spelling back and forth just to screw with everybody's heads and I was bored and Fiona Bill lovely lovely woman who lives across the pond and what is it about us Americans the minute that a Brit talks to us it's like oh right we remember all of them it's like beautiful Kay over there on her channel and there's just a whole bunch of you and Suzanne you're somewhere over it just but Fiona she just always just she just had just the light you could tell she was just a delicate lovely lady with the lightest of touches and words but always the right words and and she passed away last month her daughter Evidently she had spoken of my little channel here to her daughter and her daughter messaged me on Fiona's messenger that mom had passed and I was completely surprised and of course completely heartbroken because my last message from Fiona was that there had been a turn in her tests and she was getting better. So that broke my heart because of course it did you know and but and then I thought what's appropriate to see on YouTube so then t 
today I was on my Facebook and I was scrolling through and the other day too I was talking to you guys about all my letters and everything I have from you all not talk, not even talking about the beautiful little knickknacks and stuff that you guys have sent me and I was on my um, Facebook today and I got through my news feed that a patty whacker passed away at somebody who I just loved more than anything. She and I clicked for so many reasons and her name was Shanna. And she read me through my words and what I did and did not put out there as far as myself. And I just loved her to death. And then her mom watches the channel too and her name is Jan and I haven't had a chance to get in touch with Jan. And my heart just broken. And, and the reason I'm choos choosing to put this out there is because sometimes I watch YouTube channels and I think, do they read their comments? You know, do, uh, do they realize that, that we're real people out here? And I, I want you guys to know that. And I'm so sad to lose Shanna because I just loved her. She emailed me, we messaged. And just the other day I was thinking how I hadn't heard from her, but that's how life is, right? We go back and we go back and forth. Like my friend Cindy Pope, I hadn't heard from her in a long time. She popped up the other day, I was so happy. And that's just how life is. And I'm extremely saddened to hear of Shanna's passing. And I just needed to tell you guys that. And I wanted to read you. Uh, she sent, she sent me this email last fall when I was having a hard time. And I wanna read it to you. And I'm wearing this hat, cause in all her pictures, she has a hat on and she loved Calvin and Hobbes. I don't have any Calvin and Hobbes, but I have Mickey. And, and I loved her. And I'm going to read you the sweet thing she sent me. Where's my spectacles, Anita? Put your spectacles on. She went by Awesome Otter, if you guys ever saw any of her posts. But her real name was Shanna. And I asked her once, I said, how do I know how to pronounce your name? Is it Shana, Shanna, Banana? You know, because there's so many different ways the way she spelled it. She goes, it rhymes with banana. So I always said, oh, it's the banana, Shanna Banana. She said, oh, shoot. She sent me this email. She said, parentheses, Otter here. Didn't want to take up a ton of space on your comment section on YouTube. Here's some of my, some of my ramblings, Dr. Seuss style. <sighs> Dearest, lovely, fun Anita, you're my favorite YouTube people. Patty whacking so much fun when we feel fed up and done. Pumpkin pie, cookies, and cakes hang in there for heaven's sakes. I wish great things for all you, for all of you. I got through it, you can too. October candy, turkey day, Soon Santa will be on the way. So to all of you, I give a cheer. I've got my water and a beer. <laughs> I'm gonna miss her so much. And I just really needed to put this out there to let you guys know that you're not just people who comment on my YouTube channel. <laughs> I appreciate you all and I read everything and I'm gonna miss her and I'm gonna miss Fiona and for anybody who listened to this little whatever it is thank you <laughs> Fiona's probably not too thrilled with me right now she saw me because this shirt is really really tight and I had to dig through my drawers to find a pair of shorts that I could put on because they're all really really tight so <sighs> thanks you guys Thanks for being the greatest patty whackers ever. Drink your water, know where your bathrooms are, and I'll see you at weigh-in tomorrow.